Welcome back to the channel and today we have an update on liquidity farm. This is my seven days update. We're going to do a live withdrawal today. But of course, before we get any further, remember the usual disclaimer that nothing in this video should be taken as financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor. Treat this strictly for educational purposes. So if you didn't see the prior video, I'd recommend you check that one out on liquidity farm. Here I have the $1,201 plan, which is the farm pro. If we take a look at the different farm packs here, there are three diff uh, four different packs, sorry, the Easy, the Pro, the Pro X, and the Compounding. I am on the Pro plan. But if you take a look at the differences, so the minimum investment for liquidity farm in any of the plants is $300, which is quite a bit compared to some projects. But yeah, so the Easy plan is $300 minimum investment up to $1,200. This earns you 0.95% per day you get your earnings five business days a week and it runs for 180 days or until of course well the how long the project runs and you do get your capital back at the end of it then the farm pro which is the package i am on is 1201 up to 12,500. this package earns you two percent per day and the same with the withdrawals and earnings i feel like if you just want to test up, $300 for the easy plan is there. However, if you're looking at around $1,000, you may as well pay the extra because on the pro plan, you get that up to well, basically double daily earning percentages. Again, remember, this is crypto, so you should only invest what you are willing to lose. And that can be a lot of money here. But do your own due diligence and then make an assessment for yourself. Then there's the pro X plan, which is a minimum of a $12,500 investment. I feel like that is very, very large. You get two and a half percent per day, but I feel like that much of a jump, you might have wanted expecting a bit more per day, but that is the highest earning plan. And then we have the compounding plan, which is a 1500 minimum. You get 1.5% per day, which is compounding. So you get your withdrawal, I believe, at the end of all of that. But yeah, I'm on the pro plan here. So in the dashboard, I quite like the layout. It's quite a well-made website. You can see your active investment, daily expected earnings, total invested however many farms you've got your wallet balance so i do have 2402 which is what i earn every single day we also have my earnings overview so so far from my plan i've earned 144 dollars we can see my purchase order here and of course you can see your earnings so it is five days a week that's why we have the jump from august 25th there's no earnings on 26th or 27th but we're back on the 28th and of course my earning today the withdrawal is very, very simple. You head over to the withdrawal section here. First, of course, you pick your payment type. So you can earn payouts in Bitcoin, USDT on the Tron network or the Binance or Ethereum network. You can get payment directly in Ethereum, BNB or yeah, BNB BEP20. But I usually do the USDT on the Tron network. I find that pretty easy. Remember that the minimum invest um, withdrawal is $20. So if you have a lower investment, you will have to wait multiple days before doing a withdrawal. Also, remember, you can only do one withdrawal per day. So bear that one in mind. But we can withdraw 24.02. And my wallet, I will copy my Tron wallet, paste that in there, and then hit submit. Then once this has been submitted, we can see request successful. Your withdrawal request has been sent. The request will be processed in 0 to 24 hours. Why I also like is when you actually submit a withdrawal, you do get a email regarding that. This one hasn't come through right yet. It normally takes a few minutes, but we can see my withdrawal history. We have these completed payments. I had an error on one of them on the 24th, but the rest of them have been okay. We can see all on the Tron Network USDT TRC20. But just an example here, here is a example email I can pull up. So you get an email saying your withdrawal request has been received and is being processed. It will arrive within zero and zero to 24 hours. I think I did actually just receive my new one here. Yeah, here we can see which your request is accepted, your withdrawal request, and then that will take zero to 24 hours, which is very nice to see. Also, once your withdrawal has been completed, you will see a second email, which looks like this one saying your withdrawal request has been processed. It gives you a transaction ID and a date. And of course, then you can check that withdrawal has hit your Tron wallet. 
So what I'm going to do now is probably just wait and come back when the withdrawal has been processed. So I'll probably cut now, let you guys know how long this one did in fact take, and then show you that the withdrawal has hit my wallet. So we are back. This took around four hours, but we did get the confirmation withdrawal has been completed. And I do have the transaction on the blockchain here, 24 USDT to my address. So I did, again, I submitted for withdrawal at around 4 p.m., received it around 8 p.m. UK time. So just letting you know, it was around a four hour time frame, but we did in fact receive the withdrawal, which is of course very nice to see. This means so far earnings at $144, all withdrawn. Of course, I'm just withdrawing every single day, going to try an ROI on the protocol and we'll see how long liquidity farm can last. This again is my seven day update. I'll probably do another update in a week or so. So stay tuned for that one. Again, all of the details on liquidity farm are on the homepage. And of course, if you have any further questions, you can look at the FAQs and they do have their own dedicated support system on the website, which is also a nice touch. But thank you for watching this one. I hope you have enjoyed and I will see you in my next video.